Hello everyone, this is part two of the stay apparatus in the horse. So if you didn't watch, you know, part one, please make sure to watch it before continue with us here. Now we will talk about the other apparatus called the check apparatus. The check apparatus consists of two um, muscles. In this case, we are talking about the uh, tendons of the superficial digital flexor muscle, this one here, and this is here the deep digital flexor muscle, and this is its tendon. Um, for, just for your record, we in other dissection video, so we already dissected these two muscles in and talked about the origin insertion of these two muscles in detail. So go and find that video. It could be really very helpful to understand what we are talking about here. Now in this check apparatus, uh, I would like to tell you that these two muscles, they get like supporting ligaments from the bony structures of the forelimb. Let's start with the first one, which is the superficial digital flexor muscle highlighted in yellow in this picture here. Now, if we go to this, uh, at this level here, you will find another structures there highlighted in yellow. This is extra ligament. Uh, we name it as accessory supporting ligament of SDF, which is the superficial digital flexor muscle, or if you want, you can name it also check ligament of the SDF. So to see it in, you know, in, I mean, clear, let's just remove the deep digital flexor muscle for now. And now you can see how this extra ligament contributes. You know, can you see that? It comes from the caudal surface of the radius. So this is the radius here. And uh, it mm, contributes or fused or support the tendon of the superficial digital flexor muscle at this level here. Okay, in the same way, in the same way, we will find that the deep digital flexor muscle, this one here highlighted in yellow, has another supporting ligament which comes from the balmar surface of uh, the metacarpal bone number three, that one, of course, that one here, uh, from this area here. Let me just zoom in, take it out here, and now, you can see this ligament here, the check ligament of the DDF or deep digital flexor muscle or the accessory supporting ligament of the DDF. If you want to see it exactly, let's just remove the SDF and remove also the tendon of the DDF. And now you can see this supporting ligament. Let me just put it in the center here and rotate it to this side now. This is here the supporting check ligament of the DDF. Now uh, the two, and this is the one of the SDF, okay? Now these two check ligaments or accessory supporting ligaments plus the ligaments of the SDF and DDF, um, let me just add them. This is the SDF and here we have the DDF. Okay, all of them together, they will prevent extension and passive collapse of the joints where the tendons pass over. Now I would like to talk uh, quickly about some other muscles of the forelimb. They also contribute to the stay apparatus. And in another video later, we will talk about the stay apparatus of the hind limb, which is also extremely important. So I will add the, the important muscles here and see you later. Now, if we move uh, proximally here in the lateral view or, or let's move to the cranial view, we can see the this muscle here called the extensor carpi radialis. The extensor carpi radialis uh, um, stabilize, you know, the carpus cranially along with the, the two extensor digital muscles, the common digital extensor muscle, this one here and the lateral digital extensor muscle. So all three muscles here, as you can see, uh, fix or stabilize, you know, the uh, carbos cranially. If we move a little bit, door, you know, proximally here, we can find and uh, we can uh, we can say actually that the ventus serrate muscle and the biceps brachii, for example, both of them um, they have increased fibrous components to support the limb in this area. And let me just tell you something very important here and something we can find only in the horse. 
uh, we can find like extra tendon or in a kind of ligament originate from the biceps brachii and moves down and fused with the extensor carbi radialis. This structure here called the lacerous fibrosus. Lacerous fibrosus is like a connective tissue, very strong fiber structure, comes from the biceps brachii in the horse and uh, moves down and fused with the uh, extensor carbi radialis and the lacerous fibrosus uh, fused also with the forearm fascia combined all of these structures and serves to the proximal end of the metacarpus and that's why the biceps have provision to be able to relax without the collapse uh, of collapse of the shoulder and elbow and carpal joint somehow all other muscles you can see here contribute to the stay apparatus but in this video we focused on the main components of the stay apparatus so later we will move and talk about the stay apparatus of the uh, hind limb in the horse uh, in another video uh, please just remember that we already dissected uh, all of these muscles and you can find them in different videos uploaded to our channel. So go ahead and watch them. They will be very helpful, you know, to show you exactly what we are talking about here. So see you in the next video. Bye bye for now.